toy car of mass 6 kilograms is initially moving at a speed of 0 0.5 meters per second and being pulled at an angle of 30 degrees a distance of 9 meters without lifting the car by a rope at a constant tension of 8 newtons. So we've got a rope here 8 newtons and the angle here has been pulled up is 30 degrees. Given that the horizontal surface is smooth, i.e. no friction, find the velocity, the final velocity. So the work done by a constant force is the force times the displacement in the direction of the force which is F times S. Now, the direction of the force is horizontal, i.e. it's going to be this distance here, this force here, which is going to be 8 cos 30 degrees. So the force is 8 times cos 30 degrees. Now, we know from before that the work done FF is equal to half mv squared minus a half mu squared, where v is the final velocity and u is the initial velocity. So, 8 cos 30 degrees times 9, because the force is 8 cos 30 degrees and the displacement is 9, is equal to half times the mass, which is 6 times v squared, minus a half times 6 times the initial velocity, which is 0 0.5. So it's going to be half times 6 times 0 0.5 squared. Transfer that over to the next page. It's going to be 8 times 9, which is 72 cos 30, is equal to 3v squared, half of 6. A half a times 6 times 0 0.5 squared is 0 0.75. Making v squared the subject, we get v squared is 72 cos 30. Sorry, plus 0 0.75 divided by 3. So it's going, that gives you 20.0346, and we need to take, find v, we need to find the square root of that. So it's going to be 4.59 meters per second, correct to three significant figures. Right, the energy of, the, of an object due to its motion is called kinetic energy. And kinetic energy is equal to half mv squared. And note from before the FS, the, the work done is equal to half mv squared minus a half mu squared. Therefore, we can say that work done is the final kinetic energy minus the initial kinetic energy. Note kinetic energy is a scalar quantity, has magnitude only.